Welcome to Bible in the Beacon Hotel. We're here today with our guest, Rabbi Herzl Hefter, Rosh Beit Midrash of Beit Midrash Harel in Jerusalem in memory of Bel de Lindenbaum. Numbers chapter 16. In this chapter, we're introduced to Korach and his rebellion. Why does Korach rebel against Moses? Korach raises a very interesting argument against Moses, which is actually against the whole idea of leadership and establishment. And the challenge is very fundamental. His challenge is fundamentally religious, where why should there be hierarchy? Why should there be priests and Levites and simple Jews? Why should there be um, uh, the structures that exist in the desert where every tribe has to be in a certain place under its own flag? We're all equal before God. Right? The relationship that people have, the fundamental, of, the fundamental idea of religiosity is the individual relationship that people have with God. So why do we need all these structures? And that's the attack. The attack is on the basic assumptions of the Book of Numbers from the beginning to the end. Because Numbers is counting the people and putting them where they, where they need to be. And Korach is saying, this whole project is misguided because it has to be of kol ha'edah kulam kedoshim. The entire congregation, we're all holy. We all have God in us, u'betocham Hashem. So what's with the hierarchy? That's a very fundamental challenge. Wow, that's an amazing explanation of Korach's challenge to Moses. Now, come back tomorrow, everybody, and we'll find out why it was that Korach didn't win.